blockchain is a distributed ledger that may transform the electric grid and enable the development of a new smart grid. Its potential to swiftly process thousands of transactions per second, buying and selling even minute amounts of energy or certified delivery as truly renewable energy, is only beginning to be tapped. Over $1 billion in venture capital has been loosed to develop blockchain specifically for the energy sector, and hundreds of startups have joined large global firms in advancing the technology. Much of the early work is happening in Europe. In Spain, for instance, the utility Ibidrola successfully used a platform developed by Barcelona startup FlexiDAO to obtain a guarantee of origin for renewable energy purchased by a Spanish bank. The guarantee certified the power came from two hydroelectric plants and a wind farm in real time. It allowed automatic execution of smart contracts and eliminated intermediaries commonly used to provide such certification, normally a lengthy process. There are successful efforts in the US also. The Brooklyn Microgrid in New York City is recognized as the first successful peer-to-peer -peer blockchain system, facilitating real-time buy and sell energy transactions among 500 or so small businesses and homeowners. This model is expected to be the one to move the concept of a smart grid to reality. To be transformative, the technology has to be fast enough to handle thousands of small transactions per second at the kilowatt hour, where individual solar panels or batteries live, according to developers. The next step is improving scalability, the ability of blockchain to handle thousands of transactions per second. Skeptics point to the lack of large-scale blockchain projects in their predictions that the technology is probably years away from being viable. The non-profit Energy Web Foundation, however, is leading one project to speed the system. Its open source network is using a proof of authority consensus to speed block time, as opposed to proof of work used by Bitcoin and others, which uses great amounts of energy and impedes very fast transactions. Any of Energy Web Foundation's more than 100 affiliates, such as FlexiDAO, can work with and off the network to develop products. Regulators also are looking as various states push large investor-owned utilities to increase renewable energy sources into their generating mix and the grid. New contract types will be needed to handle a new level of electricity trading, and a new framework would require new and more flexible electricity tariffs that now are heavily regulated. Smart contracts will have to be put into the legal code to comply with the law and protect customers. Trust in blockchain systems will be placed in the technology itself rather than a central legal authority as is now. The ultimate legal and technical liability is poorly defined. If a successful hack into a distributed blockchain trading system happens, where do customers lodge a complaint? So far, developers say regulators are receptive to what's coming and educating themselves in the new technology. The Energy Web Foundation system will take a major step forward this year when it goes live and starts to process actual transactions. You have to walk before you can run, and that should be one big step toward viability.